Okay, let's talk now about the surface area of a rectangular prism. Again, remember surface area, we're going to take two times the base because we have two bases, the front and the back. And then we're going to add that to the perimeter of the base times the height, that lateral surface area of the figure. So let's start with the base. If I find the area of the base, again, uh, that's three times two. So my front base is three times two. Now I'm going to multiply that by 2 because I have uh, two bases, the front and the back. I'm then going to find the perimeter. Well, the perimeter of this figure is a rectangle. So 3 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2, that gives me 10 for my perimeter of my base. And then my height of my prism is this length here. So that would be 6. So if I go through this process, again, my total surface area, and again, this is going to be the total area around the figure if I were painting it. 2 times 3 is 6, times 2 is 12. 10 times 6 is 60. 12 plus 60 is 72. So this would be 72 square units for my surface area.